Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm doing your remaining month of October reading start from the 22nd through the 31st of October 2020. This is going to be for the sign of Virgo. So let's see what is coming up for you guys for the remaining month time. I will be adding charms, I will be putting out oracle cards as well. So stay tuned and now uh, while I shuffle the cards, let me remind you it's a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the messages which are resonating and leave the rest for personal readings. You can always reach out to me for that on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. You can also uh, check out my sister's style channel as well. I will be adding the link to her channel in the comment section. If you like it, you can always become a part of her YouTube family as well. So let's get started. Let's find out what is coming up for you guys for the remaining month time starting from 22nd. Let's begin. Three of Cups. Seven of Pentacles. I feel like I, I do see us having a lot of parties, uh, friends time, family time, uh, you know. Um, but it's, it's more like, you know, you, you are doing that to get yourself busy. It's, it's not something that you're enjoying too much. It's, it's more like, you know, you are investing yourself into all these kind of things just to ignore something which you don't want to think about. Um, and it's, it's something that's, that's soon going to uh, get you bored. If, if you are dealing with someone right now, it's, it's very momentarily. It's not going to last. It's, it's like, you know, if you, are, if you are dating someone who you recently met, it's just for some time. Like, you know, it's not going to last long because you're going to realize that this is not what you want. You are doing this just to get your, to get your mind off from a specific someone that you are trying to run away from. So that's you. That's your, your that's your intention, uh, you know, to get yourself busy so you don't think of this one person that you are getting pulled towards you really want to have fun you really want to ignore you maybe you know even if you are having sex maybe you are having sex with the specific someone and then you have somebody else on your mind because you you can't take them out of your mind and you're trying each and everything that you could to get rid of that one person from your mind it's not gonna work and you soon gonna realize that for others of you it could be just that you are having some party you are having some fun but um you are soon going to realize that keeping yourself busy with work, friends, family, gatherings, parties and stuff is not going to help you take this person out of your mind. And then what you got to do, you got to do what you need to do. So um, that's what I'm picking up. Let's see more cards here. Devil, the shadow side. You have to deal with this. You really have to deal with whatever it is. You cannot um, lie to yourself. You know, you cannot hide something from yourself. You can you can tell a lie to another person, but you can't lie to yourself. Like, you know, you eventually have to face yourself. You you cannot run away from the love that you have for a specific someone. You cannot run away from the um, from that craving that you have for this one person. This person and you, whoever it is that you're trying to avoid, trying to ignore, trying to let go of, is somebody that you are already tied to. Your heart, your soul is already tied to that one person. No matter how hard you try to run away from them, it's not going to work out. No matter how, whatever you do, you date another person, you sleep with another person, that too is not going to help you get rid of uh, that one person. Because it's, it's like, you know, it can never happen. Um, and I feel like you know, you're soon going to realize that. You're soon going to give up on doing whatever it is that you are doing to keep yourself busy and you are going to understand that this is what you want. This is what you need to pursue. You cannot fool yourself here any longer. Let's see more cards here. Four of Cups. And that's going to be the time when you are going to think of a proposal, think of a connection, think of a, you know, when I say proposal, it can be you thinking of uh, proposing someone or it can be a proposal that was made to you and that's the person you are unable to take out of your mind now. <clears throat> Maybe it's like uh, whoever it is that you are thinking about now, which is very hard for you to you know, take that person out of your mind. It could be somebody who loved you, who proposed you, and then you said no to that person. And now it's you wanting that same person. And you're now you're considering the proposal that they made to you. And now maybe for some of you, you might be the one reaching out to them or maybe planning to reach out to them as well. 
as you feel like you know you are feeling the pull towards them you are feeling the pull towards that one person and you cannot ignore that you cannot ignore your emotions for that one person it's like you know i don't see you happy with anything no matter how hard you try to get yourself busy to get you to indulge yourself into something which can you know maybe you believe can help you uh take your mind off from that one person it's not gonna happen whatever you do wherever you go you're gonna have this one person on your mind so it's it's that kind of heavy energy which you cannot run away from let's take one more card here seven of wands this whole energy building up towards preparing you to make the action or to take the action towards that one person where it is that you are unable to take out of your mind underneath the deck you do have five of swords this person whoever it is that you have on your mind has finally uh that person finally succeeded in filling your heart with their love making you understand that you are the sunshine for them they finally succeeded to make you think of them in the way they wanted for some of you this person could be using manifestation techniques here as well whoever it is that you are dealing with so that's going to be happening for you let's take some uh, oracle cards now let's see what the oracle has to add to the reading for you guys i uh, to be very honest i don't see you reaching out to this person the uh, in the remaining month time let me take one card from the middle of the deck okay eight of wands showed up so eight of wands so for some of you maybe you would be reaching out to this person uh around the end of the month time for others of you it's just that you are preparing yourself to reach out to this person that's what i'm picking up let's see what the oracle has to add to the reading for you guys let's see true love this is the romance of a lifetime you you are going to find out that this is the one that you want this is the love of your life and no matter how hard you try to run away from that one fact it cannot change if you close your eyes the person that you have in front of you is not going to go away they are pretty much there and you have to understand that if you shut your eyes or close your heart to the love that you have for this person the love is still there so just 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 know that the love is not going anywhere for you know that you have for them and they have for you so let's see what the other oracle has to add to the reading let's see your hard work is paying off i feel like you know, it is the hard work of your person like i said maybe they are the one manifesting this connection so if that's them then their their hard work of manifesting this connection with you is paying off now let's take the charm sound let's see what the charm has to add to the reading so we do have one alphabet only m so it could be your name initial name initial of the person that you are dealing with then we do have two cards seven of cups and two of swords i do see you indulging into um, you know some unhealthy activities just to um just to get clarity for others of you you are finally going to have the clarity um after having indulged into some you know unhealthy activities um i will hold you in my heart until i hold you in heaven that's the energy of your person the energies could be reversed completely as well maybe you are the one manifesting a connection with a specific someone as well um i will i will be the one for you i will be the one reaching out to you soon so i will but for that somebody is really um for some of you you might be dealing with a fish or a water sign because we do have a fish there's you know strong love emotion that you might have been trying to ignore in this connection and that's why you are keeping yourself busy doing stuff that you would not like to do for yourself but you are doing for the sake of getting rid of this one person out of your mind out of your heart but the love that you have yes it's not dying away it's not going away 
you and your person together is so lucky for each other the love the compassion that you have for them they have for you is um is is matchless so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, remaining month time if the reading resonated with you to like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye, -bye.